mercy, you make this go upon me. Let us try to understand the exceptional devotional qualities and characteristics of Srila Haridas Thakur. Due to his great humility, he does not enter the temple of Lord Jagannath, but remains here. And from this humble place, he looks upon the chakra on the top of the temple and offers his obeisances from afar. And in this way he lives, worships Srimati Tulsi Devi, and accepts a little of the Lord's Maha Prasad. He chants the holy name of the Lord 300,000 times daily, without fail. Who can imitate such a thing? Without a doubt, he is the Namacharya and has been personally sent by the Supreme Lord to deliver the fallen souls of Kali Yuga. His chanting is pure and defenseless and therefore is always relishing the nectar of love of God. Haridas, Haridas is just like a touchstone. For whoever takes his association very quickly attains the lotus feet of Sri Krishna. Once, the envious Ramachandra Khan tried to dishonor his character by sending a prostitute. Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. But she could not affect him. Instead, she was infected by his pure quality and was blessed with the Lord's devotional service. Why, even Maya Devi herself could not disturb the mind of Srila Haridas, which is constantly absorbed in thoughts of Sri Govinda. Because the holy name is always on his lips, he remains meek and humble, and therefore he has received the causeless mercy of the Supreme Lord. The ways of his good qualities are exactly like those of Mahajans. Indeed, he is none other than Lord Brahma himself. His qualities are so truly remarkable that out of extreme jealousy, the Mohammedan minister had him came to 21 different marketplaces. Haridas, he did not protest. And who can forget his ecstatic dancing at the Lord's Bhaktiyantra festival, which went on for hours and hours and hours. <laughs> this dancing filled the hearts of the devotees with great wonder. My dear Haridas, there is no end to your transcendental qualities. You are indeed the topmost devotee of the Lord, and you are very dear to me. You remain always in my heart. Haridas Nakur Ki! Haridas Nakur Ki! Haridas Nakur Ki!
and the association of Haridas Thakur. But because he is independent in his desire, he has now broken that association. When Haridas wanted to leave this material world, it was not within my power to detain him. Haridas was the crown jewel and the head of this world. Now the world is bereft of its most valuable gem. Please stay, don't go. <laughs> I thank you very, very much for this beautiful theatre play which you put up. And I thought it has, it had Hollywood quality. <laughs> uh, that, uh, how the elderly Haridas Thakur was uh, changed, changed and gave us an insight into his past. He was caned and all of this, very nice and very tasteful. Uh, even how he was tempted uh, and he remained fixed. Uh, and how Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu carried Haridas Thakur, I was trembling. <laughs> Hopefully there would be no accident. <laughs> but no problem, uh, uh, the strength of Mahaprabhu went into our Anthony <laughs> for some time. Uh, thank you very much. And uh, really, it is a heart-moving scene. Uh, very, very good. And Vaishnavas do this. They, they come together and they play the pastimes of the Lord. And there is a saintly assembly like this. And the assembly sees in these uh, Leelas of the Vaishnavas, not just Anthony or Gopinath or what is the elderly Haridas Thakur's name? Gokuldas. No, no. For the time being that they are on the stage, the stage uh, uh, becomes Jagannath Puri and the characters uh, leave their Antoniness and their Gokuldas and their Gopinathness behind and they become actually for the time being uh, the characters which they dis depict. In other words, it's a, a feeling festival, a festival or a theater where the audience allows their feelings to expand and connect with the characters which are depicted. It is a, it's a Vaishnava custom.
to have such a place. And you did extraordinary well. It was, it was really, I said to myself, I will have to give a presentation, so I will not become uh, 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 softened by the play. I will not cry in ecstasy. Hurry us. Don't leave us. Stay with us. <laughs> I, will, I will check myself very carefully with great force. It was very, very nice. At least I thought... Uh, I was uh, skeptical because um, in the early days when we heard Australian plays, just, just the, just the, Austra the name Australian theatre plays would, would send horror to us. <laughs> it usually was very gross, you know, and, and uh, liquid beauty, I remember, and such such things. But this was extremely tasteful, and I request the audience once again to raise their hands in a thunderous applause. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.